Good morning. Are we here? Are we ready for some Monday morning motivation? I'm dripping. I'm dripping with my sweat this morning. I love to wake up to a good sweat, right? Who likes to wake up to a good sweat? I do. However you do it, you got to get that sweat in. You know what I'm saying? So listen, you guys. See my cute little outfit? When I woke up this morning, I was not in the mood, right? So, what do you do to get yourself in the mood? Hey, Sarah, what do you do to get yourself in the mood? This is Monday Morning Motivation. I'm gonna tell you, we have to put some motivation into play. Now, motivation is, let me tell you the difference between, let me lower this music. The difference between motivation and inspiration. Ooh, you guys ready for this? You guys ready for this? Motivation is something that comes from outside of you. Motivation is something that comes from outside of you. And motivation helps for you to um, make that extra step when you're already committed to something. Hey Terry, hey Kenya, hey James. So when you're motivated, right, you take something from outside of you and you use that to give you some inspiration, right, to move, right? So I needed to be motivated this morning. Hey James. So I went and I said, you know what? I'm gonna put something really cute on. I'm gonna get my hair and put my pink lipstick on. I got my customized Nikes on. I don't know if you guys can see this. But these say C, C, C equals F, F, F. So then I started feeling good. So I got motivated, right? So motivation is when you go through Instagram and you see a picture that motivates you to work out, right? Then what you get to do is you shift into inspiration, you guys. Inspiration comes from within you. You own your inspiration and you get to become the inspiration that you seek. Are you guys hearing me, what I'm telling you right now? There are two things, right, that get you going. Motivation, which comes from outside of you. Inspiration, which comes from inside of you. Hey, Cheryl. So when you are inspired, that means that something within you is lit up. Something within you has that fire to say, yes, I am ready to live. I'm ready to achieve. I'm ready to be the best that I can be. That's inspiration, right? Motivation is like, okay, yeah, come on. Let me get motivated. Let me get this workout in, right? But inspiration is for the long haul, right? So let me tell you something. I am a powerful, connected, and inspiring leader, you guys. Let me tell you, I was put on this planet to breathe life into you, to inspire you. So my goal in life is is not just to motivate you each day, it's to inspire you. That means to help you dig deep within yourself and figure out that you are worthy of a great life, that you are worthy of the best that you can achieve, that you are worthy of everything. That's inspiration, baby. That's when you stand up and say, yes, I deserve it. Yes, I'm gonna be it. Because let me tell you something, the way you are in one way is the way you are in every way, right? So if you're not inspired to take care of yourself, you're not inspired to do your best at work, you're not inspired to be the best mom, you're not. You're operating on a low level. It starts within you, right? There are even some people who are like, they put all their energy on their children or on their mate because they're not inspired. That means they're getting all of their energy from outside, from others. And I'm gonna tell you guys, the best way for you to live a life when you're always feeling high. People say, Tiffany, you always have energy. Yes, I do, because I am inspired. I'm inspired to believe that this life is meant to be great, right? That this life is meant to be amazing. And that's what I breathe into every day, right? So I want you guys to say, I'm inspired, I'm inspired. And aspire, when you aspire to be inspired, you breathe life into something. You breathe life. So I aspire to breathe life into you guys. I, this is my goal in life, breathe life into you. Why? Why? Because when each and every one of you, hey Kiara, when each and every one of you feels inspired, right? Then you show up to this planet 
a better version of yourself. Right, Cheryl? You show up as a better version of yourself. And what does that mean? When you love yourself from the inside out, you have more love to give, baby. That's right, Cheryl says, she says, I aspire to be inspired. That means you breathe life into yourself, right? So you have to put your oxygen mask on first, you guys. You gotta put that oxygen mask on first. What does that mean? What does that mean to you? I know you guys are hearing me, you guys are feeling me. What does it mean to put your oxygen mask on first? That means, right? That means that you get to drink that cup of I am, right? Drink that cup of I am. And that I am needs to be something that you wanna be, right? So if you wanna be fit, don't wake up every day and say, ooh, I'm tired, <laughs> I'm tired. Oh, who sent me some stars? Thank you, right? If you wanna be in love, don't wake up every day complaining about how everybody is doing something to you, how everybody is wronging you. I want you to wake up and say, I am love, right? I am love, and when you are love, you're gonna vibrate and you're gonna attract more love in your life, right? If you, if you wake up every morning and say, oh God, I gotta go to this job, I hate this job. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna just breathe hate into your body and you're gonna come to work with a scowl on your face and you're just gonna, everyone's gonna be like, oh God, just leave her alone today. You know, who peed in her teacup, right? So this is what you guys gotta do. You gotta show up to how you aspire to be. So that means you get to breathe life into yourself, right? What does that mean to be inspired, you guys? Not only to be inspired, when you're inspired, you are inspiring, right? So I'm inspired all the time. Like I'm always living a new life. I'm creating, I get up every single day and I work out and I rise to shine. And what I do is I breathe life into others because that joy spills over, right? So that's being inspiring. Are you guys being inspiring today? Are you guys being inspiring today? Because that, that energy, the energy that you guys give me, even by hopping on this live, the energy you guys that gives me, it fills me up, right? I fill you up, you fill me up, and this is how the world becomes a better place to live. You guys hear me? The world becomes a better place to live, right? So we get to breathe life into each other. This is a circle. This is a circle of life. And it doesn't end, it doesn't end with just you. It ends with you being inspired to inspire others, right? You get to be inspired to inspire others. And how do you do that? That's how you show up on the planet. How are you showing up on the planet? Are you smiling or are you frowning? Are you filled with joy or filled with disdain? What are you filling your cup with, right? So there are some tools that you guys can use in order to lead a little more inspiring life. And I'm going to tell you what they are. Number one, stop. Oh, who said Stream Queen? Was that you, Jacqueline? That's right, baby. That's right. Say my name, Stream Queen. I'm going to own that. Thank you, baby. I see you. Hey, Bertha. Okay, she got me. She got my attention. Yes. Okay, listen, you guys. Listen. The, I'm going to give you some rules to being inspired and inspiring. Number one, stop living the life of the past, right? How many of you guys are always looking backwards for success? Oh, I used to be in shape back then. Oh, I remember I used to have that. Oh, I loved him back then. Stop looking back, right? So listen, this is a really, this, I heard this the other day and it was so funny, right? So does your life look like this? Say you have a favorite show. Right? Say you have a favorite show, which is the Cosby show, Friends, or whatever, right? And you love that show, right? And then you watch the show once, right? You watch the show once and you have a great time. It's amazing. And then you watch it again and you remember the best parts. And then you watch it again and you go, oh yes, and you share it with your friends. But then if you continue watching that same show, even though it was your favorite show, over and over, pretty soon you're gonna fall asleep on it. Pretty soon you're gonna get bored. You're gonna know exactly what's gonna happen and it's not gonna excite you anymore. This is how some people live their lives, right? Some people live their lives, I swear to God, you guys, doing the same thing every day. Your soul, your soul, came to you to have an inspired experience on this planet. 
It came to you to have an inspired experience on this planet. What kind of experience are you providing for your soul if you're doing the same thing every day? Same complaints, same habits, same start overs, right? Same false procrastination. What are you doing for your soul to have an inspired experience? Ask yourself that question. Ask yourself that question because guess what? Oh, thank you for my stars, baby. I can't see who sent them, but thank you. All right, listen, guess what? Every single time that you do something different, every single time that you stretch yourself to be just a little bit uncomfortable, you are creating a new experience for yourself right? And then your soul feels joy because you don't want your soul to be bored watching that same show over and over in your life, right? Because that's when you become bitter. That's when you become bitter. So I try and do things. I try and do things differently every day. And you guys have heard me speak on this before, but I want you to take a look at where you want your life to be, right? Where you want, I remember I had a dream once that I wanted to, this is before, this is before, um, all the iPhones became so advanced that I wanted to just wake up in the morning and in my house, turn on the camera and start working out with you guys because it was a big drama for me to upload videos and edit videos and I didn't like it. So I had a dream one day. I'm like, I just want to be able to wake up and turn on the camera and boom, here I am. And guess what? Here I am as the stream queen going live to inspire you guys every single day, right? So it starts first with a thought and then the belief that everything is possible 100% of the time. And then you guys get to do something different. You get to do something different. So if you're still here, if you are still on this call, let me tell you what I'm I'm doing differently. I am inspiring a group of people at the Fit, Fierce, and Fabulous Treat Retreat this week. Oh my God, you guys! Listen, this is the thing. I've been talking about this forever, right? I've been talking about the retreat forever, and now it's here. And for those of you who said, I want to experience something different, you're going with me. You're going with me, and we're going to Mexico. We're going to be in Tulum. We're going to be in our private hotel with our private chef. We're going to be working out, doing videos. There's going to be free gifts. Oh, you guys, wait till you see the merchandise. And I'm so excited to see your faces light up. I'm so excited to actually embrace the people that are going to be there. That's living, you guys. Living is creating your life creating your life one day at a time. What are you doing to create your life? Are you just living in the past, baby? So listen, we got one space available. One space available. One space available. We had somebody who had to cancel at the last minute, so we have one space available. Are you ready to live life on the edge? Are you ready to stop procrastinating? Are you ready to just like jump? Who's ready to just jump? I just jump and I have the best time as I'm flying through the air into my new experience, right? Just jump. Hey, Shireen. Hey, Shireen. So I want you guys to take, to take away today these two things. You can be motivated by others, but you get to be inspired in yourself. And when you're inspired in and by yourself, it's the way you think, it's what you do, it's what you believe. And in order to keep inspiring yourself, you get to be the best version of yourself. You get to create new experiences for yourself. You don't want your soul to watch that same episode over and over and over again. How many of you hang out with the same people, do the same thing, eat the same foods, right? What is that? What is that? What is that? So come with me to Mexico, right? Meet some new people. Go to a new place. Experience a new way of working out with me. Hey, that is going to be totally different, right? Try some new foods. Learn to meditate. Learn to commune. These are all the things that we do for our soul to have inspired living, right? So you can be motivated, okay? And you can put things in like my cute little outfit. It'll get you going for about, you know, a couple of hours, maybe even half a day. But when you're inspired, that lasts forever. All right, you guys, I love you. I love you so much. I'm going to put the link for the retreat uh, in the description box below. Just go for it. If you're thinking, oh, Tiffany, I don't know. It's so scary. I don't know. I, don't, I can't afford it. Just go for it. Trust me. Go for it. Go for it. You guys, go for it. I love you.